My grandfather actually bought the first 600 acres in 1948 and it's been added on to like several times since then. Um, we were a mixed farming operation uh, up until 20 years ago and now we're all beef cattle, um, a self-replacing Angus herd and Wagyu cross. Uh, so today we were weighing the last year's Wagyu Angus calves. Uh, they're off to a feedlot in Queensland. It, certainly the new yards have made a big improvement in weighing. That was a major issue in the last set of yards. Um, very unreliable weighing, but now we can get reliable weights and um, have cattle going into feedlot at the exact weight. The old yards were designed in probably about 66. Um, well, my father built them. Then he had an 80 cow herd. So although they took up a large amount of space, the same amount of space as the current yards now take up, it's actually in the same footprint. You could only put two cows up the race at one time. Um, very hard to load the race and the force. So it would be a three person operation most of the time. Here, one person can run it if need be. We're not taking up any more space. Uh, and part of um, that using Atlex's design process was that we had to fit into the old footprint of the yards because the yards were in the right location. And as you can see, we've got some of the old external fencing, cable fencing, uh, and we wanted to use the same loading ramp because as far as trucks went, that worked really well. The features that I really did want was the rotary force and the curved race. They were definitely two, two features and the pound yard being able to draft uh, easily on five ways through there. The reason I chose Atlix was the on-property design feature because we did have to fit in with the old footprint of the old yards and the old loading ramp. The efficiencies to the operation is the, the speed that we can get cattle weighed and, and through the yards. Uh, last year we reduced our cow herd by 60% um, because of the drought. So we had to do a lot of weighing, classing and mothering up and we were able to do that with the aid of the pound yard. Um, and it made a really hard job a lot easier. In my line of work, I'm working in a different set of cattle yards uh, most days. Today, in particular, we just drafted 141 young weaners. Uh, did that inside 25 minutes, which uh, is, yeah, that's probably the key, is efficiency. Uh, a well laid out set of yards. They ran well, they weren't stressed, and um, yeah, everything went very, very smoothly. Safety is very important. The rotary force means you don't have to get into the yards, into the force with the cattle. Um, the curved race and the walkway puts you above the cattle and makes them move a lot easier. So it is very important. And the man gate, we've never had anything like that before. We were climbing over fences all the time. So they're a great asset. The skillion roof's a major plus, especially in summer. <laughs> yeah. I think the first time I used the yards, it was a very hot day. And it's very thankful to have the skillion. The beauty of these yards is you can work them from outside the yard and from the crust to the back of the force is, is a, it's three steps or four steps and the cattle flow through uh, with zero risk of getting kicked, knocked over. It just keeps you safe and keeps everyone settled and, and, and you're calm. Cattle in the old yards they were continuing to stop all the time as they came to another gate and they kept on, there was a lot of balk points. Uh, in these yards they just kept on going round and I suppose the curved race has a lot to do with that and the rotary force. A uh, well designed set of cow yards, <laughs> um, you really can't go past. Um, it just it adds to the property, adds to the value of the property as well as the ease of working and safety to yourself, staff and family members.